Ontario Finance Minister Charles Souza wants to crack down on investors who may be hurting the market. Souza has also alluded to other measures that will be included and may be included in the provincial budget at the end of this month. One of those measures is targeting real estate speculators. Kelly Batello explains. An assignment clause allows the buyer of a home to sell the place before they take possession of it. This is more common in the sale of pre-built homes and condos. It can be very lucrative for investors as many scoop up pre-built homes for just a deposit and sell them to someone else for much more than they paid. But president of Mars Homes Dan Gabriel says not all builders allow assignment clauses. Well, we feel that... Uh... It's our, part of our corporate philosophy to build houses for people who will move into them. Remax realtor Tobias Smolder says investors are part of the problem when it comes to the hot housing market in the province, and the provincial government should put in place some measure to deter real estate speculators. Investors that are able to scoop up the more affordable houses and they're trying to make money on that, and some sort of taxation to make that less lucrative would definitely help the problem. Smolder says some builders are putting a price on an assignment clause, some as high as $20,000. And they know that the investor is making money and they want to get paid for it also. President of Mars Homes Dan Gabriel says while it's important that the provincial government does target real estate speculators, he says that won't get to the root of the real estate problem in Ontario. This is basically the uh, provincial government throwing a bucket of water on a forest fire. Both Gabriel and Smolders agree that the shortage of houses and a pending increase in interest rates are more significant. In addition to speculators, Finance Minister Charles Souza has also alluded to implementing attacks on foreign buyers and vacant homes. Kelly Batello, CHCH News.